brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And next time you need parts for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. In this video, we're gonna be working with our 2001 Ford Ranger. We're gonna show you how to remove and replace your headlight assembly, or you can follow these same steps to access the turn signal and headlight bulb if you need to change them. We're gonna be working on the passenger side, but this information is the same for the drivers. If you like this video, please click subscribe. We have a ton more information on this truck as well as many other makes and models. And if you need this part for your vehicle, you can follow the link down in the description over to 1AAuto.com. Here are the items you'll need for this repair. Remove the three five and a half millimeter bolts on the top cover for the headlight with a socket ratchet and extension. Then remove the plastic cover from the top of the headlight. There's a metal tab on the inside here under that cover. We'll lift up there. Don't lock it all the way up. You wanna let it sit at that float point there. Get the one on the opposite side here. Same thing, lift up, hit that balance point. You might have to wiggle them a little if the headlight's not coming out smoothly. Twist the sockets for the turn signal, counterclockwise, and the collar for the headlight spins off counterclockwise. We'll place our headlight assembly off to the side. Now, if you're just in here to change the bulbs from this point, the headlight disconnects from this electrical connector. Want to lift up on those tabs. Pull the assembly out of the socket. New bulb snaps in. Be sure that this collar sits between the socket and the bulb. Turn signal simply pulls straight out. Your new bulb pops straight in. To give you a better idea of how these headlight retainers work, you'll see the hole here where our plastic retainer is going to slide in on the back of the headlight. This is with that slide in the floating position. If you pull too far up, the metal comes through the opening and will still hold the bottom of the retainer. It's a keyhole when you slide down that thinner portion locks over the top. So when we hit this nice middle point here is when our headlight comes out nice and smooth. Install the sockets into your new headlight. Socket goes in, quarter turn clockwise locks it in place. The headlight pops in, the collar goes over the tabs and locks on clockwise. Now we'll line up these pins into the openings. Again, you might have to wiggle those slides a little to get them to go in. Once they're over, lock the tab back down into place and ensure your headlight is in straight and secure. Reinstall the plastic cover over the top of the headlight Tighten it down with a socket, ratchet, and extension with your five and a half millimeter screws. Thanks for tuning in. We hope this video helped you out. Next time you need parts for your car, please visit 1AAuto.com. Also check out our other helpful how-to as well as diagnosis videos.